The state's chief economist says Hawaii's population has decreased for the past seven years, with 15,000 people moving away last year. KITV4 Shanila Kabir breaks down the reasons why. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, the statewide population of Hawaii is continuing to decline. On average, almost 20 people left the state every day last year. And a survey from Forbes released the top five states people are moving to. The first is California, with almost 12,000 people moving there last year. This is followed by Texas, and then Washington, Arizona, and lastly, Florida. And interestingly enough, Nevada did not make that list. The rents were obviously, are obviously high in Hawaii, and I've had a terrific deal that was way, way, way under market for 11 years. But the biggest issue was very few people would take pets, particularly I have a, a Springer Spaniel. And Seattle, it's pet friendly everywhere you go. It's hard. It was, the difference was amazing to me. Barnes added he would move back to Hawaii if he found the right deal with a building that allowed pets. But he said factors like building policies and what he calls rock fever, on top of the cost of living in the islands, pushed him to make the move. A variety of people are moving. There is no trend with age or wealth. Kaylee E. Akina added half of Native Hawaiians don't live in the islands because of cost of housing. One of the major reasons that it costs so much is because we have a high level of regulation that prevents building the supply of housing that we need. So there's a huge shortage. Unfortunately, that's often caused by the hoops that developers have to jump through. Hawaii's numbers are consistent with national statistics. Texas and Florida are the two fastest growing states, while California is seeing a decline. Eugene Tian says the reason some people move is Hawaii's economy is moving at a slower rate than the continent. Uh, Hawaii cost of living has been increasing, and uh, especially housing. Uh, we experience an uh, increase in housing price. Uh, in 2022. He says the continent has bounced back from the pandemic while the islands are still struggling and that Hawaii will continue to see declines in population. Shanila Kabir, KITB4, Island News.